Good afternoon everyone, welcome back to the bookshop at Burnley Market Hall and another featured book for today which is Context by John Mine. So the cover is really cool. It's got this like guy in a spaceship sort of floating away. Um, it's quite a cool size, it's the same size as Asimov's books. Um, it's about 560 pages. And the back says, Nulla Perian, a planet isolated for 12 centuries. Its inhabitants occupy sub subterranean strata ruled by a logos, logos sophistically trained aristocracy whose power base is upheld by oracles. But now revolution has touched its many cultures, failing in its intent, yet changing everything. And Lord Tom Corrigan, the legendary one-armed warrior, one-time revolutionary and would-be peacemaker, the commoner turned noble, the poet Logos, Logosopher, and holder of the key to understanding Moo space, lies fatally wounded. His survival hangs in the balance, dependent on his confrontation with a mysterious seer who possesses transcendent space-time warping talents. However, Tom must pay a bitter price for his life. Can the woman he loves truly be dead, or can quantum mysteries lie beyond the grave? Turning his back on a society, sliding once more into anarchy, a disillusioned and despairing Tom wanders this strange, stratified world in search of meaning, lost love and his own salvation, but destiny beckons, a terrifying, insidious enemy whose origin lies beyond this world, beyond their understanding, threatens Nullipirian. Now it seems is the time for Legends to be reborn. The second book in John means his pioneering another period sequence. Contents is a thrilling, daring and complex novel that confirms its author as one of British science fiction's most original and exciting practitioners. So there we go, Contents by John Meany. It's really cool. Uh, published... Published 2002. Oh, oh no, it looks like it published 1988 actually, printed 2002-2003. Uh, so there we go guys, featured book for the day. And these are the fresh books in today. So we can quickly look at them. Uh, Ranger's Apprentice, The Royal Ranger by John Flanagan. There's lots of these Rangers thing. So The Emperor of Nyonjar, Halt's Peril. The Siege of Macedor, uh, The Kings of Clormel, The Burning Bridge, and all these covers are really cool, I think. The Sorcerer in the North, uh, another, this is Blood on the Streets, A to Z of Glasgow Crown by Robert Jeffrey. Uh, the Lost Stories from the Rangers Apprentice series, A Stranger in Tibet by Scott Berry. Uh, Erax Ramsom, The Fifth Wave by Rick Yancey, uh, Ranger's Apprentice to Iceberg Land, Oak Leaf Berries, uh, Bearers, sorry, The Hunters, The Ruins of Gorlan, uh, Breaking Dawn by Stephanie Mayer, uh, The Lost Heart of Asia by Colin Furburn, The Time That Never Was by Steve Nallen, uh, Lee Child's Personal, Second Life by S.J. Watson, Written in Blood by Charles Carter, and Star of the Sea by Joseph O'Connor. And there we go guys, fresh books in today at the OYMY Bookshop at Burnley Market. So please come check us out and I hope you all have a Good day, there goes my tripod. So, God bless everyone. Bye bye.